Okay, so let's talk about the absolutely worst thing in Mallorca at the moment. Let's talk about the mosquitoes. Now, whether you have come on a holiday yourself to the island or you've just been looking at the Facebook groups or my YouTube channel comments, you're going to see that a lot of people have been affected by mosquitoes in Mallorca. Now, I have to say they have been particularly bad this autumn. Going on through the summer, I had this, this smugness that those mosquitoes were not coming anywhere near me. But as we went through the autumn, the mosquito problem here has just got worse and worse. Now, I was down in Cala St. Vincent just yesterday. Now, Cala St. Vincent is just one of the most beautiful areas of the island, but I'm finding that these mosquitoes, and I found the same as well on the south coast down in, in Calipi, that anywhere that has these cliff edges or anywhere a little bit sheltered, you're going to have a mosquito problem. Now, yesterday I got almost chased out of Cala Clara by swarms of mosquitoes, and the little bites are just starting to appear today and at last count I have 32 of them all over my arms and legs and it's literally driving me crazy. So I have to say if you are coming out to Mallorca this winter for a winter break, if you're coming over here for cycling or a hiking break then make sure that you are prepared and you bring some really strong mosquito repellents and you bring something to treat them to. Now, I had a comment on my channel just last night from a cyclist who had been over here on a, ho a cycling holiday. He had so many mosquito bites, he ended up on antibiotics. So it really is a, a huge problem here. And you just have to look around the Facebook groups to see that we're not the only afflicted people by the mosquito problem. They are all around and it's just really annoying. And I have to say that in the northeast corner of Mallorca, the mosquitoes are just a little bit worse than maybe you'll find down in the southwest. So if you're coming over for a winter break or indeed you're booking for next summer then go and check out my Amazon shop because I have a shopping list in there purely dedicated to insect repellents and afterbites and products as well which will help keep these mosquitoes away if you're coming over here on holiday because I do not want anything to ruin your holiday to Mallorca. Now my other top tips are that if you are coming over for a winter break to wear maybe a long sleeve t-shirt, maybe wear some long sleeve trousers as well some thin trousers we still have temperature highs here of 25 degrees but I'm thinking this may be cooling down a little bit as we're going into November so of course you're going to want to be dressing a little bit more warmly and also this will help too with keeping the mosquitoes away now also be very wary over sunrise and over sunset as well when it gets to these dusky conditions because that's when they really do come out in force although I have to say when I was bitten yesterday it all happened at around lunchtime as well in the, these kind of sunny conditions down by the beach but I was in the shade. Now anywhere as well in addition to these like cliffy areas anywhere where you're going to get lots of shade in areas where the, the ground is going to be quite moist and you can see up in Cala St Vincent that they, they do have quite grassy areas up there so it is a very very damp area. These mosquitoes are going to breed so my advice is if you're over here if you're over camping if you're over hiking Avoid it, dress for the mosquitoes, take all your insect repellents, take the afterbite too. Because even one of them even got me on my watch strap too, right on the bit of skin right by my watch strap. But there's literally no escape and they will find any uncovered area to bite. So just bear that in mind. And even actually, I'm gonna show you my right arm here. I've got like eight bites on the upper part of my right arm and it's literally driving me crazy. This is just a small warning for you. Let me know in comments below if you have been affected by mosquitoes this summer or this autumn and whereabouts you stayed on the island because I really hope that this isn't something that's just going to continue as we go through to next year and I just hope you know by the end of the winter they're just going to buzz off. Okay everyone, thank you very much for watching. I've got tons of content coming out on my channel as we go through the winter. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. 
you can find me on the Facebook group and on my Instagram, also called Mallorca Under the Sun. And stay tuned as well because I'm going to be having a very end of season guide to Puerto Boyenza coming up very soon on my channel. I also have tons more information on my website on MallorcaUnderTheSun.com, so please feel free to go and check that out too. And I'm now heading off to the chemist to go and find myself some antihistamines because I think I'm going to be in for a really bad night with all these bites. It's just absolutely horrendous. So thanks very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Goodbye for now.